What is up, you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of the Patreon gang. We're going to go ahead and jump straight in to the next 24 hours. The energy surrounding what you need to know, what you need to be aware of, and what you can expect in this next 24 hours. Let's see what the energy is for you guys. Next 24 hours. Next 24 hours for the Patrons. Okay, so past life. I heard past life regression. Hmm. Are you working through some things in this next 24 hours? Okay, it feels like a healing process. A healing process. But it doesn't feel like as intense of a healing process as, as what you have dealt with previously. Um, <clears throat> this looks like, okay, we've got everything sorted out in front of us. Now let's start placing things back the way that we actually want them instead of the way that it is. Okay. Um, look, they're showing me a pantry being reorganized. So some of y'all, look, are reorganizing things in this next 24 hours or you're throwing out the things that no longer serve you. This is also showing me like a stockpile uh going through and like okay let's check the dates on this shit <laughs> throwing out what's not supposed to be there anymore or something that's outdated or ruined you may be finding something that you didn't realize was expired in this next 24 hours and you're just like shit well i wish i would have done this sooner okay so that that's what that's where we're at today wishing you would have done something sooner but it's fine you're just taking the time you're sorting through things you're getting rid of the old and welcoming in the new for some of you this could even be going through pictures because I, I, what i'm seeing is somebody in the floor um starting from the ground up restructuring um I don't know if this is pro, I said protos, I don't know. This is, this is, I'm seeing somebody putting some, putting things, putting the pieces back together, okay? Maybe you have already gone through some kind of massive shift and it's like you're needing to put all the pieces back to where you actually want them instead of where they do look, leave them where they fail. You may have been looking at things that were just sitting there for quite some time knowing that you need to do it, but kind of refusing to actually do it. I'm also seeing somebody going through like a call log and deleting deleting it i don't know if you're completely restarting your call log and only talking to the people that you talk to or there's there's something about deleting numbers okay um you may have been holding on to certain people from your past and you're just realizing why do i even have this person's number in my phone i don't talk to this individual i feel like there, there's things that you're looking at like that in this next 24 hours like why am i still dealing with this person why do i still have this subscription why am i still um doing this every freaking day knowing good and well this is not for me like i like i feel like this is this is something going on with a shift that's happening internally okay uh you've already been through some kind of like major awakening major shift and that shift hurt okay it hurt it forced you to feel all the things from your past that you may have just like set on a shelf and left i feel like you're coming back now like you've had the time that you've needed um you've prioritized and that now you're ready is what i keep getting now you're ready all right so uh the situation involves your past life memories yeah so i mean all these are pictures these are people and it's like knowing good and well, this does not serve me. And it's fine that it doesn't serve me. It served a purpose for the time being, okay? Um, for some of you, you may have... Um, some of y'all may have had your own businesses. And maybe you've switched clientele. Or I don't know if this is like... If you, this is clientele you're deleting out of your phone. I don't know what this is. But this is definitely saying you're taking a good look at... Not even what no longer serves you, but things that you don't deal with or people you don't deal with. You don't see this person every day. Why is this person in my phone? Like, I don't necessarily feel, I feel like it's phone type shit, okay? Honestly, because I don't really see pictures out here. They're not showing me pictures. Or these may be people that are not important enough to have pictures by them in, in your phone. Or some of y'all may find out that you had, um... Certain numbers in your phone that you thought that you did delete, maybe you're finding out that you don't, like this person may have a picture in your phone or, and you're, you're realizing that may have been forming some kind of tie there, like there's still energy lingering between you and a specific person, like maybe, you know, eventually things will change, things will be good and you may be realizing it just is what it is. I feel like that's where you're at. You're you're recognizing and putting things together, 
piece by piece and realizing what no longer serves you. And it's completely fine. It's not tearing you up anymore. What is that? Okay, let's let's look. Next 24. Next 24. What else I need to know in the next 24 hours? Mm-hmm. Divine masculine and divine feminine. It looks like a dance. Okay. Dancing. Trees. We don't want to go there. <laughs> Why you have to go there? Why is this? <laughs> look, this person has a whole bunch of numbers in your phone. I see because that bitch is crazy. Fell out of there. We've got ambulance. We've got, will you marry me? We've got the next 72 hours. This bitch is crazy. On bottom. Little black book. Lucky number seven. Games. Like, I didn't want to take all these, but they're already there laying out. Laying there looking at me. And ghost is on the bottom, so. Cancer, Capricorn. Okay, you may be dealing with a cancer or a Capricorn. You know. I'm not really going to put those on the screen. I'm just going to leave them off to the side where they fell. All right, so. Somebody is very interested in you. Somebody's very interested. And Aquarius is on the bottom, too. I didn't even see that. The ghost fell off of it. Aquarius, Capricorn, Cancer. All right. Some of y'all may be getting some kind of shocking communication from someone in your past. All right, I don't know if this is actually an ex of yours, but this is someone here who always saw you as somebody that they could, I, I about said score with, okay? So, um, somebody actually saw you in a higher regard than you originally believed them to, like, you didn't know this person felt this way about you. I feel like there's somebody here who's kind of trying to rush in, or it's like almost sending you messages through the dream state about the okay you might have thought that this person was crazy okay um they may have actually had really good luck i feel like this person is someone here who can manifest they may have red hair or lighter skin okay i feel like this person has been really focused on getting their finances in order before they decided to um to move towards any kind of romance or relationship. I feel like they are picking up on this energy of something possibly being too late. Or they may have missed out on something good with you. This could have been somebody here who you weren't very serious about. Like I feel like this may have been someone who was just for a good time. Maybe when you were going through your own you know karmic cycles. Where you may have been a little crazy yourself alright. I feel like there's somebody here who is like having this epiphany. They may legitimately be out by water sitting out looking at things like, damn, I really have fun with that girl or damn, I really have fun with that guy. I wonder what this person's doing now. Okay, that person is a very good manifester. I'm just letting you know. And this person has their sights on you and what could have been if y'all would have, you know, been serious or tried. Like, I feel like somebody saw marriage with you or saw some kind of long lasting connection with you. With that little black book, I feel like they may be looking at their options in this time and like whole, like they're like the ambulance being above the little black book. They're just like, oh, hell no. There are certain people, they, this person may have just gotten back on the market as well. Okay. Um, and they're looking through, you know, the people who they saw uh, potential with. And I feel like you were one of the people that they saw potential with, okay? This is somebody from your past. Divine masculine, divine feminine energy. I feel like maybe y'all were both going through a stage at the time where y'all were either hanging out together or something of that nature to where things just didn't line up. It's like y'all's goals were different at the time. Um, this person... 